Ralph Irvin at Spalding Field. Day one of UCLA spring football practice in the books. Here with UCLA sideline reporter Wayne Cook. And Wayne, what's your report? What would you see out here uh, day one at Spalding Field? Uh, for one, it's uh, it's definitely UCLA. It's about, what, 80 degrees and perfect out here at UCLA. So that was nice. But uh, I was very impressed. I thought that the uh, the team, we know the offense was, uh, they're trying to learn something new. So that was interesting. But I love the speed. I love the guys running around. Uh, a couple of things that really impressed me was how guys weren't allowed to do things. Like, for example, a receiver got in a fight. He was immediately pulled from the drill and said, I can't play with you. You're going to get in fights. It's going to cost us penalties. You're going to get kicked out of the game. Those, to me, are great examples of this staff bringing some of the discipline that I think a lot of people want to see uh, as far as the changes that are going to come from this staff. So the discipline is something that I definitely noticed. And one thing that we saw really from the get-go at the start was tempo was up and guys were enthusiastic, but they were moving around. Talk to Coach Moore a little bit right after practice, and he said that's what they want. I mean, they really want – he thought today was just a, a, a stepping stone. Mm -hmm. You know, along the lines of we, we, were, we were okay. Right. We can do a lot better than that. We can really pick this up. And, and he just wants to be the type of coach that when they get in the games, you know, they're going to go really quick sometimes. They're going to slow down sometimes. They're going to keep people off balance. And, uh, and that's exciting. I mean, this is a fast-paced world. The football's changed so much. Mm -hmm. And when you see what the organs of the world can do, um, there's a lot of ways to win football games. But this coaching staff really seems like they've, they know what they want, and they're going to keep working these guys. Right now they're just trying to break them. They're trying to break them, but they're going to get it going, and they really have high expectations. Well, as a quarterback, I know that's a position you always look at, and I know Coach Moore was asked a lot about it. One thing that he said is he's not going to make daily evaluations. He's going to let the process play itself out, and they're going to look for where they don't have tape on guys, put them in situations where they can see just how they perform on an even basis. I've always believed that the right player will win the job. It hasn't always worked out that way here, though. I think there's been some years where you wonder if that guy was the right guy. But um, I think that they're going into this thinking that the competition is open. i got to be honest with you, for the first time in a while, I saw five guys, I mean, from, from New Heisel through Prince and Brijo and, and the new kid, TJ, and um, there's a lot of good, and don't forget Hundley, they can all throw. I mean, I swear, there's, there was times here in the last decade where there were some guys that had a hard time playing catch. And, and there was other guys that were good, but... There's five guys that were really throwing the ball around today really well, and I think they're going to let it be an open competition. And I think that it's going to, part of that's going to be who can learn the stuff the fastest too because with a new offense, it's going to be a struggle. But I thought they all looked pretty good today. All right, well, Wayne, we appreciate your thoughts on day one, and a lot of people are excited out here. I know you are, and if we see out here, we might grab you again. You know what? i, I got to tell you something. You guys do a great job. I watch you. Uh, this is going to be exciting. The talent is out here, you guys. It is. The staff's just got to bring it together. It's going to be a good year for UCLA football. All right, Wayne, thanks for the time. Thank you. That's Wayne Cook, UCLA sideline analyst for the UCLA Radio Network. Of course, the best news and notes on UCLA football throughout the spring. You get it all right here, uclabruins.com.